Oh man, Chris Tyson has faced some major controversies of what's happening in this thing. And today we got a little bit of a reaction video going on here today. And I really wanted to make like a slap video going on here. There's some other plans came up into the works. I got to, I got Turd Island in a few hours. Just really wanted to make this video. I, I've been real busy these past few weeks. The Boogie video did good. The Jack Black video did real good. The Logan Paul, the Phase Ray one, uh, they didn't do so hot. But today we got Chris Tyson, a member of Mr. Beast crew, has faced controversies and accusations. However. As the last update in July 2024, currently there are no real credible sources, but there is substantial evidence supporting allegations of not only Lolly, but PDF against him. It's important to approach such serious accusations with caution uh, and ensure information is verified by reliable sources before we really even get real deep into this. Uh, before we even start forming our own opinions, let's just let the video talk for itself. Uh, there's evidence in that video. I don't know if it's credible or not, but the guy seems like he's on a good track, a fast track uh, to success. If you have more recent details or specific incidents in mind, please provide them uh, in the comment section below or in my Discord, and I can look further into the matter. Thank you. And today, we're going to be talking about the whole shebang, shabato, shamuro, shamato. All this stuff coming on with this Chris Tyson stuff. This video will make you hate Chris Tyson. That is the alleged claim. First of all, is drawings. A Japanese manga that is explicit and involves cartoon characters. It's very, very insane. Very insane that they'd even have these kinds of things online to begin with. Like, how is this not monitored anywhere? Focused on characters and plots depicting underage girls. No, I. Oh, this could be the stuff on Twitter. I guarantee you this is what, what they were talking about on Twitter. Uh, as I saw, I've saw all the images, bro. Or not, whoa, hold on, wait a minute. I saw all the images of Chris just commenting underneath these. this guy. Uh, what's his name? It's this weird, like, lolly dude. He makes all these weird drawings. He's kind of, like, got a big channel, but... I think it's clear enough for It's this weird guy, and it's very, means. very weird that he follows this guy. It's still, still, like, 2017 is recent as that. If a real person draws or likes drawings. Super weird the stuff. Thing is... I will not make up anything or accuse anyone. I will only show some disgusting and unbelievable things Chris has done, along with proof. But now you're probably thinking, what in the world does Chris have to do with all of this? They like it. They even had a picture of it hung up in their room where Mr. Beast and Chris were like roommates. There's like an, you'll see, there's an actual image hung up like in the straight up in the bedroom. I swear to God, I swear to God, bro. If that is not in this video, this video is a fail. To say the least, you're wrong and right at the same time. However, there's a very sketchy personality involved in this story, also known as Shadman. That's the that is the guy. That is the guy. That's the picture that's hung up. I totally forgot about Shadman on Twitter. The Shadman picture being hung up inside the the bedroom of Chris Dyson. It's all there. It's, it's better be. It has to be here. It has to be. Shadman Finally, somebody's talking about it. Until he decided I want, to attend an I want, art university and just like to pursue his passion. Just like this, right? Just like this. This needs to be done. The uh, the Kiwis drama needs to be done. That story needs to break too. I think I'm going to be the one to break it again, bro. It happens every year. These people can't keep getting away with the same thing with Mini Lad. For art. However, shortly after, he was expelled when some of his artwork was discovered to be illegal, even considered a danger to society. But something more extreme was about to happen. He launched his own website, and that's when his talented artwork Insane. came to light. In 2011, he did a very disgusting and unexpected thing. He released art of his own mother. That's so As weird. expected, he didn't stop there. Someone will tweet on November 8th, 2016. That's so weird. There's got to be some kind of mental illness thing there. There has to be more than just that. That's crazy to me. Asking Shadman to draw Keemstar's daughter, who was seven years old at the time. Guys, subscribe to the homie here. Adrox. Subscribe to Adrox. The link to the video will be in the description. Doing inappropriate things with Donald Trump. Shadman will respond by saying that if Trump wins the election, he will deliver it. And as we know, Trump wins, and as promised, Shadman will post drawings of her in an I did not know that. Way. As if this wasn't enough, this is gross. He will release a drawing of her giving head to Donald Trump. However, Shadman's Whoa. vision was much worse than that. Whoa! Event. On January 24th, 2017, he posted a picture of Daphne Keene, referring to oh, the her girl as from a Logan. Real life Shopping, okay. Just a few days later, he began posting drawings depicting oh, her come being on, severely bro. molested. What makes this even more disturbing is that she was only 12 years old at the time. Yet, yeah, this wasn't the first time Shadman has done something like this. Lieutenant Corbis is also one of them. But aside from all that, a new question arises. How are Ava and- You guys are sick. You guys are sick. Absolutely. That's disgusting. You guys are disgusting. These people need to be put in prison. They need to be tried. They need to have their mental health evaluated, bro. This is disgusting. Absolutely ab abysmal behavior. Abhorrent. Abhorrent. Shadman linked. 
Well, the answer to this is another drawing by Shadman. It depicts a young girl wearing a please be patient, I have autism cap, pointing a gun at her mouth. She has a fidget spinner as an earring and a spade tattoo on her thigh that says BBC, which we all know it oh, okay. means. Yep. On November 18th, 2017, Ava responded to a tweet from Grande and Mr. B stating, this is coming from a guy Whoa, this is coming from a guy, Whoa. guy who owns a shad based drawing and has it as a centerpiece in his living room. Just some time later, they also posted the exact same drawing laid on the floor with the caption. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. This was, why is it, okay, why, Bonus fidget why was it censored before if you're just going to show the real thing? All right, whatever. Spinners to throw some extra autism. Initially, it seems Chris was being sarcastic because this tweet came after Shadman had drawn all those disgusting images. However, I wonder if that started there for Chris. Something messy was going on behind the scenes. In this Mr. Beast video, you'll notice a very familiar thing at the- Oh no, not my boy. This is what I was talking about. This is what I was talking about right here. This is the- Oh my dude. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Nine minutes and 30 second timestamp. Look at how uncomfortable Jimmy is right here looking at this thing. What the fuck? From what I believe, keeping illegal art in the bedroom isn't normal at all. The shocking thing is that Mr. Beast and Chris were roommates during that time. Yup. Yet this is nothing in comparison to the next incidents. On April 16th, 2018, Ava replied under a deleted shot. There we go, finally. Saying, no beast boy trap, Shad? You've changed. Basically, Ava was asking Shadman to draw art of Beast Boy. As Beast Boy was shown at different ages in the show. We can't say anything for certain, but that doesn't mean the tweet wasn't strange. No, we can say something because every single iteration of the Teen Titans he has been under 18. Though we definitely for can't the say one the movie. same about the next tweet. On January 17th, 2018, a person tweeted saying, remember this growing up? Me too. Check it out at Chadbase. Oh, this is the Kai. The photo of the this is the Caillou thing. It's fucking disgusting, ladies and gentlemen. I advise you not to go check this out. Please don't. Cartoon character Caillou with his mother. Obviously, we know Chadbase is a website with very disgusting content. How is this, how is this even allowed on YouTube? Characters. And the tweet clearly referenced that. But instead of opposing it, Chris joined in and replied, help, I need an adult. I don't think there's any need to explain how crazy this stuff is. But what's even crazier is Ava's next tweet. Dog, right, I, and Dipper I can't. Our 12 year old siblings. I can't. This is what I mean. This is what I mean by leave the kids alone, bro. These motherfuckers are online, bro. Leave the fucking kids alone. There are kids that are definitely seeing what you're doing online, bro. I can't. All I can't support it. I cannot support it. On July 14th, 2017, a user tweeted comics of these characters kissing. Ava replied, they're twins, so at this point, it's just. Ma yeah, this one. This, how did Mr. Beast not drop him here? Mr. Beast has got to fire him. Got to fire him. I mean, it's almost unbelievable. People have been let go for less from jobs. You got to fire him. Even Chris Tyson was tweeting this. This just reflects their personality and feelings. The strange part is that they delete most of their tweets later on. Anyway, Tyson's tweets will only become more shocking and unusual from now on. On June 21st, 2018, a user posted some scenes of a 14-year-old character named Violet from the movie Incredibles. Ava replied saying, Loki, she's cute. The fact that Violet was 14 and Ava was a grown adult makes this even worse. The surprising part is that Ava wasn't just reacting to Shadman's work. They were friends or knew each other, to say the least. On April 16th, 2019, Ava will post a clip from their live stream where they accidentally visited Shadman's website. What's even weirder is that they gave him a shout out stating, shout out to Shadbase for having safe for work drawings today. I accidentally pulled up his website on stream. However, if you still think this is a coincidence, the next incident would definitely change your mind. On January 25th, 2019, Shadman posted a picture of a character called Raftalia from the Rising of the what Shield What the Hero. fuck? There are two versions of her in the show. In one, she's 17, and in the other, she's 10. Shadman posted a 10 year old version stating, what is this and why do people keep sending me this? Ava replied underneath saying, please Shad, please. No. I believe everyone understands what this means. As Shadman is basically an illegal artist who draws this stuff. Obviously, this is messed up, but things didn't get better. On January 24th, 2020, a username- I guarantee you, homie pays a premium for these two. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Him after replied to Ava with a photo of a- Holy the story shit. behind this image is that there are two versions of the image, one with the girl clothed and the other without, and the post was liked by Ava. My my big thing, why why do they private likes on Twitter? Why do they do that? Why? 
Who are we protecting? Why? These were just the incidents that had proofs or were recorded before they deleted everything. One of the tweets, which wasn't clear or was out of context, said, Nothing gets my knob cranking like some. As you gotta fire him, bro. You gotta fire him. You gotta fire him. As we know, the meaning is inappropriate. Yeah, get rid of him. But let's just let it go. Now, some people may argue that these tweets are years old. I want to clarify again that I am not hating or accusing anyone. This is purely for educational purposes. It's important to I can respect that. I can respect that. Understand. That's that what I reiterated when I started uh, the whole thing. That's what I that's what I started. Okay, cool. Ava was invited to the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards, and everyone should be aware of this. The fact that Shadman wasn't just an artist, but drew literal kids is even worse. He was basically a predator. This situation has led to me thinking about one thing. What might have happened between Chris and Katie, as most of these tweets are from that period. We can't make assumptions, but who knows? This might be the reason. That's still 2016, bro. That's not that long ago. Actually, that's almost 10 years ago. Holy f Wow. But yeah. Still, even in 2016, we all knew. Come on. Come on. I think me and Chris are the same age, too. The best I knew in 2016. One important takeaway from this is to stay away on the internet, too. It's not as safe as it looks. Absolutely. Absolutely. Guys, thank you for listening, watching, and subscribing. I love you all. Please be good, be kind, and safe to each other. Um, call all this stuff out. You see this shit online, call it out right away. Make your videos, make your dockets, everything, bro. We cannot let, we cannot rest with these fucking people, bro. And yes, I mean these fucking, these kinds of people, bro. They're sick. You're sick. If you're defending them, what the fuck? Emergency alert, brother. Sus. I'll see you all next one. Peace out. <laughs>